Hey there players, how's it going? This is Tim and this is the Mary Linton mission of Red Dead Revolver 2. Mary Linton has requested your help in a letter, so here she is. This is one of the last missions i got left, so hopefully after I've done this one, it should unlock some more missions. So I'm already here, right where I need to be. Hopefully she is in here. What's going on, Mary? Rocking up quite late to your house. Hopefully we don't scare you. Yes? Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you, ma'am. Uh, is, uh, is Mrs. Linton in? I'll go see. Mrs. Linton? I call her for you. Hello, Arthur. Boom chicka wow wow. I heard you and your friends was around. I... Okay. Where's what's his name? Died. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, me too. Happened a while ago. Pneumonia. Bad business. Sure. So, uh... You've been made a widow and come here looking for me, is that it? No, ain't like that, Arthur. Oh, okay. I... My family... I need your help. You mean the family that always looked down on me? You want me to help? It's my little brother, Jamie. <laughs> I always liked Jamie. At least compared to the rest of them. He's broken Daddy's heart. Daddy has a heart. Don't make me beg you, Arthur. Honey, my me. I wasn't good enough. I'm sorry. We need your help real bad. Little Jamie's joined the Chelonians, that strange religious order. Good for him. They're quite mad, Arthur. They'll kill him. You're the only person he'd listen to. So, I'm too rough to marry into your family, but it's okay to ask me to help in saving your family. I'm sorry. I understand if you don't want to help me, but... But I think of you often. A long time ago now. I'm begging you, Arthur. I say let Jamie live Jamie's life, and not the nightmare that his daddy dreamed up for. Jamie's so innocent, Arthur. She thinks of us often. We better do it. Arthur. Will you help me? No, of course. We've got not bugger all else to do. Somewhere out near Carmody Dell, I think. The rancher there said he'd seen him around the Cumberland Forest area. I just want him back, Arthur. If you find him, bring him to me at the station. I'll see what I can do. I'll owe you. You already owe me. Alrighty, let's go get a brother. Oh, what was those options? Oh, I reckon I probably should set a marker. Where are we going? Is it across? a uh, long way away. Alright, well I'll get my butt there and I'll speed up the footage so you don't have to watch me go on a 15 minute horse ride. So hopefully I should be there in like three. Overtaking your buddy, sorry. some stuff for my horse. I haven't worked out how to feed him yet. Probably make him go a bit faster. Which 
should look into it. This house looks way too small for this dude. Probably should go to my local horse dealer. Get a new model. Need to get one with a uh, cup holder. Nah, no, lady, maybe later, if you still need help. I haven't let him sleep for a while, he's probably tired. Always forget to sleep in games where you can sleep. That's interesting. Some dogs after me. Whoop. Oh no. Ah. Yikes. Watch out for the woos. Well, that was foolish. Let's roll, buddy. I'll try and stay out of the way of wolves for you, dude. I know you're not into that. Yep. Shop left. Yeah. I think we've almost made it. This is where the cold is. What's going on, cult people? Oh, they're doing something, something weird. Safety on the on the edge of a cliff. That's really unsafe. <coughs> Gotta speak to the boy. Arthur. Hello, son. Your sister is very worried. The boy has chosen a path, sir. Path to truth. Well, his sister just wants to speak with him. Arthur. I've chosen a path. The boy has chosen a path. He's chosen safety. What path have you chosen, sir? I ain't chosen no path. I'm still searching, I guess. We are all searching. Chelonianism is about searching. What do we search for, do you think? Turtles. It's on your shirt. I better go along with that. I don't know. Safety? Safety and meaning? Jamie knows the truth. 
But of course, you may speak with him. Exactly. If your teachings are so great, what harm can I do? I'm... I'm not... I'm not coming with you, Arthur! Just come and speak with Mary! Let... Make up your mind! Leave me alone, Arthur! Alrighty, this is a bit of a hard mission, so you want to keep kicking your horse, but not too much. Otherwise, he'll, uh... Stop, he'll get angry and buck you off. So I'm going to tap him a fair bit just to try and keep close to this dude. Because you could have a bit of a combo with him. Oh, I stacked it right in between the horses. Is that even possible? I think I've can't pass the mission now. Pretty much stuff that from the beginning. Alright, so when you come over here, you want to stick to the right so you don't cark it. And there's another little gap just about here that you want to take. There it is. So you don't jump off that mountain and hurt your horse. Alright, can I catch him now? Probably not. Where's the little prick? Fucked it up, I know it. Fuck. Alright, this is a hard mission and I've failed it many times. So you gotta uh, keep pressing your horse accelerator or kick button and you can get that initial bit of speed up. I'm going to keep doing it, but if you do it for this whole mission, eventually your horse will get angry and kick you off. So you, it's a bit of a toss-up. You've got to try and keep up with this guy, but keep tapping it. But every now and then, give it a break. Alright, so this bit, you want to stick to the right, so you don't go off that little canyon. And here you want to go through, the, there's a gap about here. That's the one you want, so you don't hurt your horse. Come on, Jamie, your sister's worried about you. I was doing just fine by myself. Damn well, I'm giving him a bit of a tap again, just to get that speed up. There's a cornfield up here. I reckon we shouldn't go through it. I wonder if we can avoid it. Maybe I just need to go the exact same way as him. Live the rest of your life in the mountains with those people. Yeah, baby. All right, my horse is running out of stamina, so I don't know whether to keep kicking him or what. What are you talking about? You ain't no killer. Alright, this is a bit where I carked it last time, so you want to keep up with him here. Oh! Bugger! Please, Arthur! I'm a man now! I, I found something! A calling! You're just a kid! You're making a big mistake! I'm not taking advice from you! You're an outlaw! You leave me alone! They're good people! I'm warning you, Arthur Morgan! Leave me alone! Please, kid. Put that gun down. I warn you, Arthur! I'm... I'm gonna... I don't want to live anymore! Kid, just calm down. Leave me alone! 
Alright, we got a what the hell about tree? Oh, he killed himself. That's a bit harsh. Let me try that again. I warned you, Arthur. I'm I'm gonna I don't wanna live anymore. Kid, just this arm Jamie. Slowly press the right trigger to fill the meter. Close enough. Let's go see your sister. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Have I been a terrible fool, Arthur? I don't know. I don't know enough about it. But one thing I do know, there ain't no shame in looking for a better world. <laughs> I missed you, Arthur. Are you and Mary sweet on one another again? Oh, no. That's all a long time ago, son. All right, we gotta take Jamie back. What a miss! Thought today would turn out. It's been a long time, Jamie Gillis. You were a kid last time I saw you. you. Didn't try to kill yourself. You know, you taught me how to ride a horse. Too well, apparently. Spoonie, though, Billy, you'd fall for that. They were very nice to me. They're decent. I'm sure. Please tell me you didn't give them any money. Of course I did. They rely on charitable donations. Jesus, Jamie, come on. I just wanted to believe that there might be something good coming my way one day. Guess that's dead in the water. With the turtles. Shut up. All Father kept telling me was, you won't amount to anything. You're not enough of a man. I had to get away. I couldn't take you anymore. Forgive me. But your father's a bully and a coward. Don't listen. Hey, don't talk about him like that. What do you want me to say, Jamie? He's a good father. Nice man. He won't be happy I saw you. Please send him my worst regards. The thing is, he's right. I'm not good at anything. Come on, that ain't true. Tell me something you like. Um, well, um think too hard. Apples, I guess. Apples? Yeah, I love apples. Okay. I'll say more along the lines of carpentry or horses or something. All right, go work in an orchard. By that token, you must really like shooting and robbing people. I only like shooting young idiots who run away from me when I'm trying to help them. Father told me what you do. I'm sure he did. Are you still with Dutch and what was his name? H Hester? Jose. Yep, still the same, sort of. And Annabelle and Bessie? I'm afraid they're dead. Shit. Maybe Mary did make the right choice. No doubt. But none of it is anything like the nonsense you read in the newspapers. So, are you two getting back together? I told you, no. Just ask me for a favor. You know Barry Linton's dead? Pneumonia. He told me. So the door's open, so to speak. That's all in the past. Different people now. She's not. And you seem just the same. Well, maybe that right there's the problem. She was always too good for me. Here we are. She must be waiting inside. Guess we'll go around the back, eh? We going in then? Hell is your problem? <laughs> oh, sorry, dude. I did not mean that. You yeah, I'm so nervous I just won't punch random people in the face.
come home. Please, you've... Father's been very sad. Father wouldn't know sadness if it died in his bed. But I'll come home for you. My boy. My sweet boy. Come on. Oh, Arthur. Thank you. Thank you. It's good to see you, Mary. And you, Arthur. And you. Well, that was good timing. I've... You're... Oh, you'll never change. I know that. Well, we saved the kid from the crazy religion. The luckiest man alive, and I feel like a fool. That woman confuses me and plays me for a fiddle like no one else alive. I trust I will not make a god-awful fool of myself once more, but somehow I imagine I shall. More than likely, brother. All right. Mission complete. We love once in truth. Part three done. Thanks for watching. I'll be back with more, y'all.